Hello YouTube, it's me, Gorn Fan, and today I am doing the Bernard's Truck Series. Now, this should be interesting. The entire top ten is in a battle. And then the bottom two, which I forgot to mark. Oh well. Oh, so we are guaranteed to see, like, four people on bull that are in a battle. Oh. In the standings, and... By the entire race. Even they're out. They're still in there. Because yeah. literally there's so many eh, that we literally cannot keep That we will... That should be very interesting. Um, for the battles, we have Jordan Diesel and Amy Sheldon being the most interesting one as it's a battle for the lead. Then it should be... Then will be... Uh, Rack, Mark, and Robert battling for third. Earn. Then there is Riley, Chris, and Nick, uh, all battling for six. Well, Chris and Nick, Nick are tied for seven. Then there's James and Alan, who are tied for ninth. Then Eric and jo Eric and Sean on uh, uh, just man just best each other by one this week, so Um uh, Yeah, four I believe that's four races left after this week, because I know that the chase started two weeks later for the this one, so there will be two more weeks after Lowe's Lowe's finishes and are for it to finish. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm go going to do a season 3 for Bernard's or not, though. I definitely would need to find a new mod. Uh, I'm not sure about the speed truck mod. Because uh, I do know that I already have that mod in the game, so I won't even need to install it. Uh, uh, but, uh, I guess that's that. We'll see you guys for the Super Speedway Type Road course. Oh. Okay, so I. But the pace strike is off now, and I guess we're going to go green now. Oh. Um. In all honesty, I don't really have anything to talk about. It was like. Probably Bernard's and Lowe's will be up on the same day, because I recorded Lowe's yesterday. For. and woke up. Up a lot later than I normally do today, so I didn't upload those today. Oh well, I st I just no need to upload the those tomorrow because I got got another day. As Chris, wa nope, Amy Shelley was still able to keep Chris under control. As now he's locked up there on the top line. Line, and and. Nope, no trouble. Oh. Well, let's slow down for Mark Cavanaugh, though. As I start watching the pace truck. Uh, oh, three wide. Oh. Mm. Um. So, if Jordan's going to win, he's going to need to come up from 16th. Ouch. That's not going to be very likely. Oh. Uh, as Robert makes a move to that corner, and I will try to make make it in along with that corner, but I'll have to drop back back or have that exact thing happen and drop behind I'm ready to k 13 as I slam right into the wall providing a slowdown for Alan Kavanaugh and there was Amy Shelley going for a second and um, um, it's really with this one it's really not 
uh, passing type track. Like, if you're gonna pass, you have to pass it in a corner, pretty much. Uh, or hope that they go and hit a wall. And then just like you can zoom by them. Um. But yeah, I made tests with like, uh, with this track again, with like more cars and see if then it becomes interesting. However, I also would need to come up with a backup race, just in case of I like I uh, don't have something there. Uh, as Amy hits the wall, that would not uh, open up the door for really anybody, but really help out how Robert Cisneros as that uh, uh, goes and slows down his biggest competition. And yes, I do mean his biggest competition, because there's nobody that can beat him other than Amy Shelley at this point. Because you can literally only pass like one position. Maybe two in a quarter. Uh, and there goes Chris Washer for second place. Is he gets up that corner? Uh, however, also if you're on the top, you can easily lose two positions, and it's in one corner. Uh, oh, he's catching Jin Robber right now. Oh. Uh, Oh, uh, however, it also looks like, like, Alan Kavanagh will have of a little bit of help as well as a little bit of help from the wall as, as Chris hit, hits it, sign down Amy Shelley. Um. So, also, forgive me if I'm at all quiet in this, is because, like, one, I don't want to wake anybody that may still be sleeping, because it's 7 o'clock. Normally, I would be watching, like, videos as at this time, but, um, but the only reason why I'm not, it's because I got... Uh, the internet up simply for po points, and that was a bad, uh, so I didn't go to where I normally watch videos, as Rob and Alan uh, Cavanaro passes Robert the scenarios as I go and start talking about, about why I'm talking quietly. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Robert probably hit that wall. Oh. That's the only reason I can see on why, why the top line was actually starting to pass somebody here. Oh, pit stops. Oh, so Nick Cap's actually is leading. Um, I wondered where where Alan and Robert were, but I just can't see them. Um, and so he's able to hit like two hundred five. Wow, nice. He will certainly be the card to beat then. Provided he doesn't hit the wall. Oh. Uh, because I have seen... Like, I haven't really seen 205 reached at this track. Like, uh, since I did it with the Indy cars. Or is back in, like, Season 1 for Target. I, I believe that was it. Uh, still need to 
wait. Oh, uh, still need to figure out where to. I can download to do cars for it though. Oh. Um. Oh, uh, probably a mess up on their their thing. Um. Uh. So they have about a five lap fuel window. So it really makes things interesting. Um. Oh, now they're trying to go up into the 200s. Where's the 8 at? Oh, behind Jordan. And, um, yeah. Pretty interesting. And then that, that happened. Uh, I honestly thought they would have been doing, like, better. Though, also, to be fair, I thought that there would be, like, caution by now. Uh, so let's see how far back he is and everybody else. Let's just see how much of a runway show this is. Very much so. Unless something else happens that he's suddenly like. He suddenly loses speed, or they. Or. One of the, those two uh, things happening is fine by me. Because I truly do not care what happens as long as something that happens. Um. And you guys pretty much know that. Uh, uh, I truly, like, I care enough to run them. That's about it. Uh, I do not, that's, uh, like, I, I care enough, uh, enough to run them for the people that want to watch the races, but other than that, I, I just don't. Really, a care like, I, uh, like with with me, just as long as I get a race, is I hope that's interesting. But if it's not, like, oh well. Um, definitely that was lows. Like, I if I didn't do it today, today, I uh, it would be because uh, I definitely would need up. Up tomorrow. Oh. Oh, uh, because it's either that or I live stream on Saturday. And with the internet that I have, live streaming does not work well. Oh. Oh, so yeah. Oh. And I also don't want to take a break for a week, even though I probably could, because I have. Plan of other videos, uh, so I could go and do like one video with us. Um, uh, and also, uh, with the first Saturday, and uh, well, I think it's the first Saturday, like it's the first and second day of October. I'm not sure which days those are. Or it could be like a Thursday 
uh, uh, sorry, a Tuesday, and a uh, Wednesday, Wednesday, uh, but I believe that's like Saturday and Sunday maybe that that happens. So just like if it is Saturday and Sunday, uh, and I do go and have Bernards and those start up by that point, which. In all honesty, I don't see why I wouldn't, because I would even start. Because as long as I get, like, a good field amount, I would go and still do it. Uh. Oh. Okay, so pit stops should be happening like next lap. Possibly this lap. Let's just, let's just literally look at him. Yeah, I definitely think that there there have been pit stops. Either that or just. As Alan Gabnaro is completely right away with this one. Uh, well, uh, with the Maker 300. And, and just so you guys know, in fact, you probably have guessed, guessed, guessed by this one, I can't talk, talk from time to time, and two, two uh, that I am not very creative with names. Um, and Nick Caps will once again start leading. We'll see if that's a good strategy. Mm. Though, of course, if he can't... That, actually, no, that may be a good strategy. Yeah. Because usually by the time that he makes it to his pit stall, it's usually the next lap, so... Oh, uh, he should be pitting and heading on that when we're on 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 like three or four to go. Oh, uh, so pretty much his next pit stop after, like, uh, he will pit on lap eighteen. Then the next one, uh, well, he'll pit this lap. Next lap, he'll oh, sorry. Next time he will pit will be lap eighteen, and our. Right after you complete lap 18 or complete it. And then just uh, that the next pit stop will be like like after lap 16. So everybody else is doing like 5 a lap. So they would need to be pitting in like lap 20. So uh, that may be a very good strategy actually. Because uh, uh, if you see how far away Mark Cavan... Alan Caminara is, 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 like, the only, like, he would at least tie Alan Caminara in points from this race. Is, so, yeah. Well, uh, he's not tied with Alan Caminara. Alan Caminara, I find it funny how probably the two people that will win are actually uh, tied for a oh, sorry, sorry tied for seventh and tied for ninth. So like they're two low people that can still probably win the championship. One's a little bit skeptical because it it's it's nineties. So. But hey, I've I have a lot further people back uh, in lows. I mean seriously, I can't. Have one person that's still in that's a hundred over. Oh, sorry, that's a hundred back. Uh, in fact, probably Keeley is still probably uh, could be termed in the chase. As, as, uh, based on how close he is to chase people, I would say he probably could have been termed in the chase because he's only. Because he's 120 back from James and Allen, so. Oh, uh, he's been running pretty good, actually. 
Well, I do kind of hope that he comes back next season as well, but, eh. I probably won't see that guy, well, see the person that who signed them up daily anymore, so. Actually, no, I know that I won't, won't see them pretty much daily. Eh. And by that I mean just, like, every weekday besides, well, every day besides, like, Saturday and Sunday. Because uh, normally I would have had, like, a class uh, with, that, with that person. And so, uh, I will see them at least once daily. Uh, except for those days. Those. Those. So pretty much when bowling was happening, and and the only day that I get, got a really a break from everybody at school was Sunday. Eh. Uh, uh, what's one? It's kind of needed to have a break at least from time to time. Um. Though also, I don't. Ca like, I'm not sure which one I hate more. Uh, having a period uh, that I want to record with him, but I can't. Or a period where I see him pretty much every day. Uh, or every day besides Sunday. Uh, I probably would hate the not be wanting to record with him, but not being able to record him a lot more. I probably would hate that one a lot more. Are uh, than the seeing him every day thing, cause it's just like, uh, with me, no matter how much mad you get me, it's just like, uh, if I go and express anger at you, wait till the next day to uh go and start, like just uh, kind of uh, uh, give me a little bit of space on the day that I express anger. Next day, just, uh, just go ahead and be your normal self, because I will be... I will just pretty much act like I'm perfectly fine. <laughs> I mean, that's usually how it is. Like, I could be mad at somebody for, like, eight months. Express that anger. Uh, and just, like, after like after those eight months, like, once I express the anger, er, uh, and then just, uh, that... Uh, we, then just, like, after I express it, it's just, like, next day, it's like, oh, hey, how have you been? Really? I was mad at you yesterday? I don't know why. Hey. Uh, so, yeah. Uh. Uh. <laughs> literally, I can, I can hold, like, a grudge, but eventually, it, I will forget it. In fact, probably I'll forget get it in like a day, unless it, unless it's like really freaking bugging me, and uh, I will usually forget it within a day. Oh. Uh. Uh. Wait, is he going to try to stretch it? I think he's trying to stretch it. Uh, not that I truly blame him. I mean, like, seriously. Oh. Uh. Wait, the eight fitted? I'm pretty sure this is a pit stop thing. Oh, it's Amy that was a lap down. Um. 
Oh, wow. So much for the strategy I thought he was going to go with. So now he's ahead of a lot of people. He just needs to be ahead of Mark Kavanaugh, though. Oh. Wait, no. Not uh, Mark Kavanaugh. It's Alan Kavanaugh. I was looking at the 99. Sorry. Eh. I'm used to only having, like, Mark Kavanaugh. Like, I'm used to those. Those. Those where... I don't even know why though. Like, I was watching the twenty eighth, so I should so it would have been more. Uh, so, so I should more should have said like Jonathan Tomman fell singing those. Uh, uh, oh wait, no, I was talking about the Carboneros. I was like, only yeah. I'll, so I was uh, so if I was singing those, then yeah, I would be thinking Mark because Mark's the only one that's in the those. Okay, so Alan's caught up to speed, and he's won the race. And Alan's won the race. We're just watching his victory laps, as he's won led pretty much every lap today. This is the only thing that I hate about the road courses. Like, it seems like every time that I head to a road course, there's, we always go, we always have one person. That dominates the race once so they get to first. First, I mean, when seriously, like, Watkins Glen, it was Hikili. Forgot who it was at Sonoma. And then I forgot what other road courses that we've done, done on this year. Er, and then Alan uh, Kavanaugh is dominating this one. Unless some freak thing happens that takes out Mark Kavanaugh, he will win. So, sorry, but I have no commentary for a victory lap. Sorry for victory laps. Oops. 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 But since it is a victory lap, let's, let's just watch the person that's actually leading. Let's just watch Alan Kavanaugh go and take his two victory laps. I'll show you the last two of his victory laps. Actually, technically, the five, five of his victory laps. Because he has to go and head back to Pit Road again. Um, he would need to, for somebody else to win, pretty much they would need him to pit, and then them to stay out, but I think, and be able, well, you would need to pit this, they would need him to pit this up, they would need to not pit this up, and then have enough fuel to make it around to lap 22. As I did the end of the race. Which I think that they made sure that Alan Cavanaro had, had enough fuel to you know, make it the full way. Mm. 
I'm so thankful that that's the final out. Mainly because nothing was happening. I am seriously like his closest competition. 11 seconds back. Honestly, I thought that a super speedway type road course ours would be a lot more interesting than what this actually is. But, oh well. It's whatever, I guess. Let's And yay, the race is complete. Not officially complete, but still, it's somewhat complete. Oh, uh, there's the left down car. There's third vanishing. There's fourth vanishing. There's fifth vanishing. Here comes a lot of people vanishing. Drag race and Jordan got the drag race. Uh, and the official standings. And the only one that did not need to cross the line was James Judd. And so, I guess please like, comment, and subscribe. Guys, enjoy the race now. See you guys next time.